Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, I want to remind you guys that we are still on target watch. We had this video up at around 6.45 in the morning, so just be on the lookout. Go check your target app, check the target website, just be aware that there is potential that a target drop could have happened and or is ongoing and or is about to happen as well. So we'll talk about that a little bit more in depth and in detail for it. And as you guys kind of know, when it comes to these videos, we usually like to go and schedule them out right around that time. So just in case it just happened, don't mind me and let me know how it goes. In case it has not happened, be on the lookout. We have been seeing some kind of conflicting stuff, and I'll have a chance to go and see fully whenever I'm fully awake myself. So we have a lot of stuff to go talk about. We also have other stuff besides Target as well, and we also have other various things, second chances, a lot of other various news going on throughout today, which is always very nice to go and talk about. So we have a lot of things to mention, a lot of things to go and say, so let's go talk about it. As well, if any of you guys are brand new, make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on. As well, for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway, Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc digital console controller. Twitter and Twitter stream as well, link down below. Sign up for Weeble, deposit $100, get a bunch of free stock, free money. Same with that Coinbase too as well, and let's go dive into the actual video itself. So, first and foremost, you guys can maybe skip ahead like two or three minutes or so. If you guys are like two, three hours into the video or just, you know, just doesn't happen or whatever, just so you guys have the heads on up, we have other stuff to cover. But first and foremost, Target. Now, we did go make a few videos on this, and like I said, I'll have it up at 6.45. I may even be currently sleeping by the time you guys see this video, so if it randomly dropped at, like, 6.32, don't mind me, because it's you know, it depends on the region, because it is an online order local store pickup. But uh, if you guys want to be on the lookout, we have him hearing some conflicting stuff, so I'll be very intrigued to go and wake up and see. So if you guys want to leave a comment down below, or just let other folks know, or all the usual stuff. I made, like, so many videos, so I think people know the rough times, all that type of stuff. I'm sure you guys know. But... Be on the lookout, the PlayStation 5 Disc, PlayStation 5 Digital, and Xbox Series Xs are all should be coming into stock or flowing around when it comes to the PlayStation 5. So, uh, we just know a stock is there, so if you guys want to be aware, the next half hour especially, or like I said, there's if there's any movement on the website itself, or like I said, maybe a little bit of you dropping it right now. That's kind of like the weirdity, you know, of actually making the video itself. Uh, although we have been hearing conflicting stuff, so if it does not restock today, we made a video yesterday discussing and talking about the fact of how stock itself was apparently being delayed as well from the West Coast. So with some stores had stock, some stores have been sitting on stock, it really can kind of go either way, and we're kind of just awkwardly kind of just being like, well, it could happen could not happen i don't know <laughs> so like i said i'll, I'll kind of probably wake up myself and go and see so you guys want to send me a tweet send me a youtube comment or give me the deets on all the stuff that's going on you guys are 100 down to let me know uh playstation 5 disc should be dropping whatever it does same with the playstation 5 digitals but as well we also are expecting, if, if it doesn't like drop today, like don't be too, too disappointed. We'll be trying to watch on for Friday too as well. We usually see Wednesday, Thursday, Fridays. And on top of that too, if it doesn't happen for this week, as we covered before, we did see a little bit of issues in terms of like shipping, shipping and warehouse distributions. So at the end of the day, don't feel too, too bad about it. But we are at least still watching it and kind of vibe with it. So at least all around good stuff with that. Uh, and as well, we'll see you next week or not. So that's first and foremost. Part two. I want to give you guys a quick little new heads up that we actually covered yesterday. Walmart actually did go and have a pretty, pretty intriguing update. So this actually kind of pertain more if you guys were a part of the previous drop or not. Walmart itself did go and actually have a second chance option. So the second chance itself is basically if people talk to you live chat, customer support, and all of that. And they had a chance to go have a restricted link. Now... We were hearing rumors as of last night for 48 hours, so if you guys got an email from a canceled order from your PlayStation 5, go and check your email or check your Walmart order, especially if you guys had a PS5 digital or a PS5 disc from the previous prior drop. Uh, some people were just messaging uh, live chat support, and they were able to go be like, hey, what's good? What's Gucci? Uh, can you go give me some stock? Give me some hookup? Blah, blah, blah. So we were seeing some people doing that, uh, and then people were able to get individual links. We were also seeing some folks seeing that they were getting more information soon from uh, customer support. Just basically everything we had a chance to go and see, we've been watching and chilling with. So, Good stuff with that. We enjoy seeing that. Life's all good and dandy with it. Be on the lookout for it in case you guys would like. Uh, and as well, if you guys need to be careful when you guys talk to live chat, basically ask them for either for, like, make sure you guys don't have your order properly canceled, unless it was already canceled. If it was canceled, try to get, like, a gift card, try to get a restricted link, try to get a special link, 
complain. And as well, we've been seeing a lot of folks getting gift cards, money off future orders, and all that stuff for their console and console drops. So just want to let you guys know we are watching that. Just want to let you guys know we are seeing that. And just want to let you guys know, please do it if you guys were affected. We did not go actually go and see any Walmart updates, although Thursdays usually are the YOLO days for Walmart. So just in case you guys do want to be in the lookout, be aware that we have seen Walmart go getting stock, and be aware that we have been seeing Walmart in the hookup. So keep that in mind. Uh, but probably nothing throughout the day itself. Part three will be on the Best Buy side. So we've been seeing loads, and I mean loads, loads, loads. And this is probably the biggest probably priority, I would say, for the day. Go and check your local Best Buy. Use the app glitch. Try to get your PlayStations, your GPUs, your Xboxes. We have been seeing loads. And also the dates we keep on hearing too from employees are around the 6th, around the 7th, around the 8th. We've been hearing those specific dates. Also the 5th too as well. But obviously, you know, the 5th and 6th have already passed. So if you guys want to check, as per usual, reminders, download the Best Buy app. Go and search in your local area for a PS5 or a GPU or Xbox, whatever you're looking for. As you guys go and get that stock, if it shows up, uh, whether it says it's unavailable, sold out, or just normal individual stock, then you guys go to that store. So you guys have a few hours before some Best Buy stores open. Go and check and see. And with that, uh, basically, we've been seeing people like camping out of stores. We've been seeing people showing up at openings. We've been seeing people calling stores. You kind of got to play it by ear. I do think with how like widespread this glitch is now getting, I think we saw a few news articles. I mean, we've been talking about this for like a month and a half, <laughs> funny enough. But we have also been seeing other news articles as well showing up and then basically talk about it. So it's, it's becoming a slightly more normy and slightly more well-known. And I do think Best Buy wants to continue doing this in the long term, mainly because it's been going on for a while. I mean, I guess we'll see in like the next week or so, but it, it basically just go and check your stores, go and see. I think pretty much, I think the numbers we had specifically for yesterday was 150. So if you guys do want to get some stock or stock movement or all that stuff, be on the lookout for it. Go try to get that good good. So all around should be nice and good with that. Best Buy's been looking super snazzy for that one. You can do that for all the consoles, GPUs, and Xboxes. Now, as well for part four, as well, we are still overdue for a Best Buy online drop. Although with them doing this weird in-store drop, I do think it doesn't seem as likely. I myself would probably not be betting money on it. I myself would probably be chilling at the end of the day. So just keep you guys on the loop for that. Uh, we are watching that stock overall. Uh, so just be on the lookout. 9 a.m., 5 a.m., give or take. 9, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. or so if Best Buy wants to do an online drop. But like I said, check your stores. We're getting a lot more people confirmed getting stock from there. Amazon, as you guys always know, we do always have the Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc and digital and all that good stuff. I will stand by still. Probably not going to happen, but in case you just want to go and check and see it throughout the days or whatever, you guys can always go check it out if you guys would like to. Same with the PS5 disc in digitals and all that good stuff, if you guys would won't. And as well for other various stuff too, GameStop, we did see commissions update, although we haven't seen any tweets or like the emails that they usually do right before a drop happens. So the likelihood of a GameStop drop pretty, pretty low. And as well, too, when it comes to all the other stuff, Ant Online's been super quiet, I think, throughout this week. Unless I miss, I can do a quick little double check over here, too. But I do think Ant Online's been very chill. And plus, every pretty much every other place, too, as well, on top of that, not good. Like, I don't know. It's just been kind of really quiet. Uh, actually, no, apparently, I'm looking over here. Apparently, the Xbox Series X did go in stock from Ant Online, too. I don't know. When it comes to Xbox, I'm always on the mediocre side. So if you guys do want to go check the online, you guys can for that one. It does look it's actually still on up as well. So we can still be on the lookout for PS5s and all that type of good stuff, but that's all we kind of saw throughout the day. Now, as well for other stuff, too, Gamefly has been quiet. They are overdue for the PlayStation 5 console, so be on the lookout for that and those as well. All the other various mid-tier plays we keep mentioning, such as the Costco's, the Sam's Club. Sam's Club did do PS5s, overdue for Xbox. Costco themselves, overdue for PlayStation 5s, I believe, too, as well. Uh, just in case you know missed all that stuff. Just if I also had anything slightly off, don't mind me, but I think it should be all good. Uh, and also still the Lenovo's, the Dell's, the Microsoft Online's for the individual Xbox Series X's. And all that stuff floating around. Just letting you guys all know they have been very proactive and they have been overdue so be on the lookout for them if you guys would like and as well for other very stuff we did not go and see any playstation directs so unless they do a random yolo public queue we're probably not expecting too too much going on from them and as well we also did not go and see much other stuff too uh just for like the general like news besides the walmart stuff that's still i think the biggest thing and now on top of that as well be on the lookout too for all the walk-ins we have been very very chill on walk-ins although thankfully the best buy continuation is still going although most other places 
places besides maybe the occasional GameStop for a leftover stock is looking pretty dry and barren. We haven't seen much more updates for all those locations, although you can still be on the lookout for them. Kroger's, Fred Meyer's, and BJ stores for online, and same with military. They're also still very overdue. So that's pretty much about it for us on the day. We'll see how Target goes. Be on the lookout for them still. Best Buy is still a big priority, and everything else is a little bit more on the chiller side. So make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc digital console controller. Twitter and Twitch stream as well linked down below. And sign up for Weeble, sign up for Coinbase, and I appreciate you guys all so much for watching. And hopefully today will be a fantastic and lovely day. Love you guys.